Hello and welcome to CCIEadvisor.com. In this lesson we'll be discussing the command show VLAN ID, which that command needs to be followed up by the VLAN number that you're interested in seeing the statistics for. So let's go ahead and get started and let's take a look at this. As you probably know from the other videos, the command show can be truncated as sh for speed. VL is the abbreviated form of VLAN. ID will be ID. And hitting the question mark you can see that we are talking about the VLAN IDs and uh, we can go ahead and type in 10 because 10 is our example typically. You can hit the carriage return at this point if you would like to go ahead and see the results. We're going to go ahead and see the results for show VLAN ID 10 and you see all the pertinent information the VLAN which is 10 the name, which in this case has been typed as the uh, 10th floor data VLAN, the status, which is active, and which ports it's on. That is usually the information that you're going to want to be interested in if you are looking at, let's say, what, what interfaces do I have VLAN 10? on for. Well, here you go. Right there. There'll be multiple ports if it's multiple ports. The next line will be VLAN, which is 10. The type, Ethernet. The SAID, which we rarely use, and the MTU. These fields are rarely filled out. The parent, the ring number, bridge number, SDP, bridge mode. And remote span VLAN. It's disabled. In other words, we have not enabled it. There's no primary or secondary types, no private VLANs in this case. So thank you for joining us for show VLAN ID command reference.